this is the box and we're going to show you what's in it and before you buy the product if you're in the store uh, like all of our water filters look on the side panel there's a flow rate chart which will show you how much water these will flow at a given temperature the, te the flow rate changes as the temperature of the feed water changes so you can see if this water filter is going to meet your needs before you buy it maybe you'll need a bigger one maybe you'll need a smaller one maybe this will fit just right so let's show you how to uh, what's in the box so these are two of my favorite water filters for a good reason uh, these are the smallest water filters around that can flow 400 gallons a day incredible flow rate out of these units um, and if you're going to be a high volume water maker the EX400 Tall, which is probably my favorite small water filter we make. In fact, it is my favorite small water filter we make. Uh, it has extra tall pre-filters, which can give you a carbon capacity double of what the, the, e the standard EX400 will give you. In fact, all of our small water filters have 10-inch uh, pre-filter sumps. The EX400 Tall has a 20-inch pre-filter sump. Uh, that's good for about 5,000 gallons of RO water. Again, these were meant to be the entry-level water filters. They're not on the GX bracketing with the handles, and they don't have the stainless steel liquid-filled gauges. They are the scaled down, but we scaled them down and upped the flow rate on these 400s. So these are real popular for that reason. Inexpensive, uh, solid built. They still have all the dual O-ring fittings, the American-made fittings, the John Guest fittings, a uh, steel pressure gauge, two of our GXM 200 uh, gallon a day membranes which equal 400 gallons a day, an electro galvanized powder coated bracket, wall mountable, um, just really solid high volume water makers in a small package. Awesome RO. Another uh, feature of these units, unlike the EX100 and 200, the entry level stuff, these 400s come with flush kits right from the factory so you can purge the membrane of pollutants that build up and it makes it easier to flush the membranes and the carbon so forth. So inside the box you're going to get a manual, a filter wrench for removing the pre-filter sumps when you want to change the uh, carbon and the sediment filter. You're going to get 10 feet of quarter inch and 3 8 line for the drain and the feed water supply. You'll get a garden hose uh, adapter for the input to adapt it for a garden hose. You get a drain clamp. You can plumb up to an existing pipe for a drain uh, to pump the drain to. And you get an extra ball valve, which you can use to shut off the RO uh, or use it in the water system downflow of the RO or for whatever you need it for.